everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel so in today's video i will be sharing some tips with you guys how you can look always put together if you put a little effort in how you look you just feel a lot better at least i do and with this video i don't want to say that you have to do these things of course you have to do what makes you feel good but these things really help me personally and um, so i thought i share them with you these are some things that you can do every day that just makes you feel a lot better and if you feel good in your skin it also shows so um, yes, let's get started with this video. But first of all, if you're new here on my channel, I'm a Dutch girl and I'm living in Marmaris, Turkey. And I make a lot of beauty related videos, lifestyle vlogs. If you like that, make sure you subscribe. And now let's get started with the video. I made a little list on my phone. So if I look down sometimes, uh, that's why. So the first thing that really helps me to look more put together is to choose my outfit the night before I go somewhere. Somewhere. If you do this, you are sure about your outfit, so that makes you feel also a lot better in your skin. Sometimes I have an outfit in my head and I think, oh, that will look great together, but then when I put it on, it looks awful. And if you are in a hurry in the morning, um, you don't want to do that. Then you are stressing about what to wear, and I think if you do it the evening before, you try it on, uh, then you know it's good and you look nice. Or if you have some free time, you can just just choose some outfits just try things on so you have some outfits uh, planned for that week and I think that way um, you save a lot of time and you always look put together the next tip that I think is really important is to find clothes that looks nice with your body type there are lots of videos on YouTube how to know what is your body type you have like an hourglass a diamond a round uh, there are so many different body types out there and you want to find clothes that looks nice with your uh, figure for example i'm an hourglass my shoulders and my hips are on the same length and i have quite a small waist so i know when i pick a outfit or my clothes uh, my waist is like my best asset is that how you call it <laughs> But um, yes, it's really nice to know your body shape because that way your clothes fit you nicely and you just look a lot more confident and nice. So find clothes that fit you properly. And also something that I really want to share with you is please don't try to fit in clothes that are a size too small only because the number on it. I think a lot of girls and ladies out there are trying to fit in clothes because of the number on it and just find clothes that fit you nice so don't focus on if it's a small a medium a large um, don't look at it at all just look at the fit of it there are so many different brands out there and in some brands i need a small extra small some brands i need a large so just don't look at it just find something that fits you properly that way you just look nice and comfortable in your clothes the next tip is to have nice uh, nails i personally love to paint my nails always a different color if i paint my nails it does make me feel a lot more put together and i just love to experiment you know with different colors and shapes i do my nails myself so you don't need to spend a lot of money at all but the thing that i think is important if you don't have time to paint your nails at least make sure that they are all the same as uh, shape and size so not that one nail is really long and the others are short or uh, that you have some leftovers from your nail polish because I think if you have some leftovers from your nail polish it just doesn't look really nice and put together so um, yes that's something that I just love to do uh, personally if you don't have the time to paint them just leave them but just make sure that they look clean and all the same size something that makes me feel really nice is to put perfume on if you're wearing a perfume that does make you feel um, sexy confident and whatever you want to feel you go to your work or whatever i think a perfume just gives you that confidence and of course it's always lovely to smell nice and find a perfume that does make you feel good perfume is such a personal choice so like i said just find something that does make you feel good in your own skin and i think it does really help with looking nice and put together and you can always bring it with you in your bag so during the day you can just spray a little bit of extra perfume on and that way you just smell always nice then a little bit of beauty tips 
Um, it's always nice, of course, to style your hair, to curl it or to straighten it, whatever is your preference. Um, but of course, it's not always good to use a lot of heat on your hair. So what I do if I don't want to curl my hair is to put it in a nice low bun or in a braid and then put like a little headband in my hair. And that way you look really nice and still put together and people see that you put some effort uh, in your look. So be creative with your hair. I'm a hairdresser, so maybe it's easy to say for me. When I worked in a hair salon in the Netherlands, uh, you always have to look put together and I didn't have always the time in the morning because I was in a rush so yeah just be creative but something that I wouldn't do is just to put it in a high bun because your little hairs in the front will go everywhere so if you want to look put together you can better just put it in a low bun and then onto makeup and of course I understand you don't want to put everyday makeup on I also don't do that but if you want to look put together and you don't want to spend a lot of time on your makeup um, I think it's a really great tip to keep it really minimal but to put like a darker nude or like a vibrant um, color on your lips depending on the season of course that way you don't have to spend a lot of time on your makeup but if you put like a vibrant color darker color on your lips it still looks really put together that's something that I always did when I went to the hair salon if I didn't have time to do my eyeshadow and all of that I just put a nice lip on and and done it looks nice you look put together so if you don't have a lot of time do that then something that just makes you feel a lot better I think is to always remove your makeup before you go to bed I know this is something really personal but I just can't sleep if I have makeup on my face like I just have to remove it and it makes you feel just a lot better also in the morning if you go to bed with your makeup on it's so bad for your skin and it does just make you feel like really greasy so always make sure to, re to remove your makeup before you go to sleep when you wake up in the morning with just a fresh skin it's just a nice start of the day and I think it just makes you feel a lot better about yourself so these are some tips on how you can look put together if you want to share any tips with me I would love to read them let me know in the comments down below and yes I really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give the huge thumbs up and of course don't forget to subscribe I upload twice a week every Wednesday and Saturday and you can also follow me on Instagram and I hope to see you guys very soon in one of my other videos. Bye!